milkshakes ate that entire peanut butter and undies sandwich. Uh. Believe it, like I told you, nobody can beat me at do the dare. There's nothing we can dare that shakes won't do. The guy even counted all the floor tiles in the swell mart. Seven million three hundred and four. Nah, I can think of something. What about going to the haunted part of the mall? <gasps> ah! Do the dare. Sweet. There. Did the dare. Oh, come on. This place was supposed to be haunted, but it's just filled with boring old people stores. I don't know. Fake teeth are kind of creepy. Like I said, nobody can beat me at do the dare. I'm not scared of anything. <laughs> Never mind. It's just my shadow. Ah! Wait. <laughs> That's just my hand. What are you doing there all hanging off my wrist and stuff? Do you guys smell that? It smells like old pennies. Or like a sweater vest in the summer. It's not me. I smell jockstrap in autumn. <laughs> what was that? Oh, right. I get it. A floss more often. <laughs> Ghost, a grandpa ghost. Oh, great. Here comes another Nate Urban legend. See, once upon a time, there was an old man who used to sit on a bench in that weird part of the mall. Every day, he yelled at kids. He yelled at kids for years and years until he eventually turned into a ghost, a grandpa ghost. People say they can still hear his strange ramblings echo through the halls of the Swell Mart. It must have been Grandpa Ghost who scared us. Not that I was scared or anything. God, this is big. This is my chance to prove the ghosts are real. And I'll interview him. I can write a story about what the world was like when everything was in black and white. How could you see traffic lights? No way. This so-called spectral grandpa phenomenon must have a scientific explanation. And I'm going to find it. Also, does anyone have a file? I think I broke a nail scratching that TV. Sweet! So, where's this ghost of yours? Oh, right, not here, because ghosts don't exist. Ooh, what about the temperature? It's so cold, like when a ghost is near. It was just the AC blasting. <gasps> and that's just teriyaki. What? <gasps> Grab a ghost! Yes, Nate, like I was saying, there's no such thing as... <laughs> <laughs> so, how is acting like New Age hippies gonna help? We need to channel his spirit and get some answers. <sighs> now, uh, I think we have to hum or something, I think. <laughs> Grandpa Ghost, we are gathered here to summon you and find out what you want. Maybe he's looking for the nearest bathroom. Nuh-uh. I think he says Lily's dope. <laughs> guys, guys, I just used my vocal sound wave recorder to translate Grandpa Ghost's ramblings. Listen. Lovely weather. We're having tea. Wouldn't it be swell if we could all chill together, old boy? I could go for some chilling right about now. Wait. So Grandpa Ghost was just yelling at those cool retro kids because he was just excited and wanted to chill with them? <laughs> Ew! Great balls of earwax! That's what I've been trying to say for years! Let's hang, dolls! Do people even say that anymore? Having our own honorary ghost suite member? Of course that'd be cool! Cool! Woo-hoo! You whippersnappers won't regret this. We're gonna have so much fun doing cool stuff together. We're gonna be best friends forever! That sounded a little ominous. 
<laughs> Wave 99, and we're loaded with ammo. Nothing's gonna stop us from finally beating World Exploders 3. Where did the exploding go? Wait, is that a ghost butt? Vern! So what game are we playing? Pew! 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 Did we win? <laughs> Nothing like a plate of fully loaded tacos to teach your stomach a lesson it'll never forget. <laughs> Ooh, gotcha! Burn! Ghost goo! Not cool, Gigi. But at least my taco's still clean. Tacos? In my day, we used to call them Mexican meat holders. Used one as a sleeping bag once I did. <laughs> no! Those were fun! That'll get your trunks a tootin'. <laughs> Still good. <laughs> oh, come on! Hey, that one wasn't me. <laughs> Sorry, Nate. Let me guess. Another burn? Burn! Let me try you off. Whoa! Please! won't leave me alone. He thinks I'm his pet hamster. Oh, don't mind the food, though. Oh, he burned my favorite blaster trying to make s'mores. We're there for you, Ninja. Grandpa's gotta go. But hey, things can't get any worse, right? Every time. Emperor, what are we doing at this nondescript Earth Mall? Six words, Brian. Two hot tubs for the price of one. Wait. Seven words. Oh, wait. Nine words. Oh, no. Ten. No. <sighs> but we're in control of the entire planet. We can just take anything we want. Twenty-three. No. Can I just start over? <sighs> We need to get the Braylings out of the mall before they realize it's our super secret headquarters. First, a ghost in the mall, and now aliens. What's next? A werewolf? <laughs> I think I know how to get rid of the Braylings. <laughs> I think I just broke something expensive. With a dreamy werewolf with hot abs? With an annoying ghost. Wee! My hamster friend here says you're ready to party. Isn't that right, Archibald? Make with the pellets, old man. I was thinking maybe we could do more cool stuff. Oh, that sounds great. Um, but I was thinking of playing Scare the Aliens. Uh, what now? Oh, it's the hot new game all the cool kids are playing. Cool kids? But just the kids that are so cool that they think it's lame. But then that makes it even cooler. Hot dog! I mean, I don't like care and stuff. I think you'll be needing these. <laughs> Commence operation. Boot out the brainlings. Come on, Brian. There's barred goons around every corner. <laughs> I've heard of these blackout sales. Be on the lookout for an argyle sweater and matching socks. <laughs> Brian, did you hear that? <laughs> Will you relax your spooked pinkness? This so-called spectral phenomenon must have a scientific explanation. Hey! <laughs> Everybody chill! Can't you see it's just a cheap parlor trick? <gasps> Aha! Now let's see what this ghost is made of. Get out of there! Get me out of there! I'm gonna keep you hanging! I think I pooped my panty pack! What? <laughs> Nobody can beat me at scare the aliens! Not that I'd like care or anything. That was the most fun we've had in a long time. Yeah, I know. Though we might be a little rough around the edges, Gigi makes a pretty sweet, sweet member, am I right? Best friends forever! Five! Not I'm okay! I learned 
something about being cool today. It's like cool to like not care and stuff. I think the time has come for this ghost to move on to a better place. Goodbye, kids. I'll miss you the most, Archibald. Wait, did we just get ditched? Burn. <laughs> now, let's play a game called Do the Dare. I dare you to eat a undie sandwich. <laughs> Why would anyone eat this? I know. I personally would have pan fried them in olive oil. Maybe add a dash of salt, some belly button lint. Paranormal, but we're afraid, very afraid to ask. Here it is. We're dealing with were vampies. Half werewolf, ow! Half vampire, half zombie. That's too many halves. But never mind the math. How could this happen? My specimens. They must have come into contact with the brainlings somehow. Anyway, were vampies are mindless, ferocious, nearly unstoppable, and really gassy. See, huh? Hey, Shakes. Oh. Oh. Ah! Ah! Shakes, Bambi! <laughs> totally disgusting and rude, Mud. <laughs> Perimeter breach! Oh, don't you dare, Shakes. Make sure to get... Out of this. Oh. 
off, sweet. Lily. Louie. <laughs> Turret. Well, well, well. Look what got flushed down the toilet. Are you here to draw my bath? I think my feet stink. <laughs> oh, yup, they do. If you don't let us go, we'll all be bathing in Weir Bambi drool. Weir Bambis? You mean those furry brainlings we escaped by retreating? <laughs> I mean, those doomed creatures whose doom we freely chose to plot down here. So you want to hang here and wait till we're all turned into half werewolf, half vampire, half zombies? That's too many halves! Yeah, you two done catching up yet? We need to get those werevambies before they get us! And how would you go about getting them? Do you even know how to stop a vampire, let alone a hybrid one? Well, duh! Wooden steaks! And garlic! Of course! Do you know how to stop werewolves? Double! Duh! You need silver to stop werewolves. And zombies? Ripple duh! You go for their brains! Come on! Don't you see, guys? With your combined knowledge, we might have a chance at beating these things. Hmm. Well, if we work together to find the right ingredients... We could theoretically end this temporary setback. Temporary truce? Very temporary truce. You see? Look what we can achieve with a common goal and a common enemy... <laughs> Louie! Oh. It's okay, Mr. Ducky Wonky. Ah! Ah! We're surrounded! We need an exit strategy. Up! Uh, go! go. What? what? Stop, stop calling me. me! No, you stop! stop. Banana, Banana dishwasher! That, that was weird. weird. I have no idea what's going on! Go get it, boy! We need an antidote now! <gasps> the grocery store! It should have all the supplies we need. And the closest one is that way! So that's problematic. Yeah, problematic for those weird babies. Follow me! <laughs> I like this game. I call it shove them something. Almost there. I win, I win. I totally shove something. Jumbo and I will hold them off. Go find the ingredients for that antidote. Lily, we need something silver. Brian, find some garlic. I'll figure out the zombie part. I don't take orders from humans. Less talk, more walk. <laughs> She's very pushy, that one. Tell me about it. A zombie. Uh, stop it, brain. Uh, stop it, cold. Cold. That's it. Glitter. Cake decorating glitter. <gasps> Silver cake decorating glitter. Can I take my bath now? All that running and shoving made my feet extra stinky. The only stink I care about is garlic. <laughs> oh, brain freeze. Silver. Garlic. Mustache. Nice hustle, team. Oh. the antidote, but now how do we give it to all those werevambies? I need some inspiration. I'm taking a shower. <sighs> oh, nope. Still sticky. Uh, that'll do. Brian, quick, help me move this machine. I got this. <laughs> Oh dear, <coughs> are you okay? <coughs> but I just showered. Almost there. A 
God, the wear bees are almost here! Okay, done! Oh no! Behind you! <laughs> oh, poo. <laughs> Sweet! I mean... Hmm. My mortal enemy transformed into a snarling, drooling monster? No, that just won't do. Time for a cold shower! <laughs> You aren't so bad yourself, human. This could be the dawn of a new era of sweet brainling relations. So you want to let our parents go? 